guys, thanks for checking out Clever TV. We are here hanging with Lucas Kruikshank. Hello. What's up? How are you doing? Good, thank you. I feel like you've been so busy. And your latest project <laughs> with Nickelodeon, you're joining the family again for Super Ninja. Yeah, it was a blast. That <gasps> show is crazy. I felt like we were shooting like this big like action movie while I was on the set. It was cool because like obviously I haven't participated in any many fights in real life, so I gotta do oh, fights bummer. on camera. But I mean, after doing this, I'm decided I'm gonna fight a lot of people at school. Like, <laughs> the lunch hour, and be like, everyone gather around. There's gonna be a fight right now. You're gonna have like the same choreographed moves over <laughs> and over again. Yeah. <laughs> what was it like learning the moves to participate in Super Ninja? Um, well, actually, my character, Kick Butt, he's like a wannabe superhero. Oh. I mean, he isn't like legit or anything, and he doesn't really end up hurting people, like, unless it's like just like luck was not on his side. So usually, um, like all the super ninjas and everything, they have like this, ex I was about to say explicit, but I meant like intricate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they have like this intricate choreography. Uh -huh. And, but I had to go through like fight choreography too, but my stuff is mostly just like being in the middle with a golf club, like swinging it around and stuff like Oh, wow. Yeah, but I wasn't like doing like any like hardcore stuff. Oh, okay, I see. I mean, there could have been a chance for you to get injured though, like with a I golf know. club swinging around. Luckily the golf club was like rubber, I think because they didn't trust me with like a real metal one. Oh, that was pretty smart though. Yeah, I feel like I would have been felt really bad if I injured the stars of that show. <laughs> <laughs> Is that like a normal thing when you're on set um, that you're not actually using like a vase, it's fake glass, stuff like that. Is that pretty normal, would you say? Um, yeah, sometimes. I mean like in the first movie I got, John Cena broke a vase over my head. Oh, and for that Fred, was, the movie? Yeah, and that okay. was a uh, fake glass. But sometimes it's real, like I've broken some real stuff. I felt bad like <laughs> for the first Fred movie. Me and oh, Jeanette no. were doing a scene and I was like, spinning around the chandelier because they told me to, but then like it untwisted and just fell. Oh! Yeah, it was bad. I broke a lot of stuff on that movie. Whoops! Yeah, it was always funny because the crew like was on, they like didn't know how to approach it. Like they were like, I was like, am I in trouble? And they were like, it's okay. Like, try not to and do it again. And they're walking away, like, angry. Like, Guard. Uh, <laughs> were there any, like, strange mishaps or funny jokes that happened on the set of Super Ninjas? Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I was First of all, I was wearing, like, this really ridiculous outfit. Like, oh, obviously I want to hear. Is have this you your seen costume? the Oops, I Did It Again music video? Oh, is that but what you're wearing? <laughs> <laughs> it's similar. I'm wearing like this what? whole body spandex outfit. <laughs> what? <laughs> I know. I feel like I'm lying right now, but I'm not. But I'm wearing like this, this full body. This is kick butts costume, right? Yeah, kick butt. I wear this full body blue spandex outfit. And I remember we did fittings and I was like, this is uncomfortable. Like I'm just wearing this spandex outfit. So luckily they gave me shorts to put on over this spandex. <laughs> when you were shooting too? No. Or did you have to wear full spandex for... The show. For the show, but I remember we were doing fittings for like the costume. Oh, and yeah. And it was first of all just like a spandex outfit, and I was like, this is sort of awkward. Like, can I wear shorts maybe? <laughs> I was like, this is a kid's show. Like, what's going on? But then, um, <laughs> and then I have like football pads on and like a mask and a helmet. Mm -hmm. So, Kick Butt is obviously your superhero. How does your character actually like fit into the storyline? Um, how, yeah. do, how does he get welcomed into the Super Ninja Yeah, family? well, he's he's always been at their school. This hasn't been on camera yet. Oh, yeah, it's Spencer. I see. He's I Spencer see. by day, Kick Butt by night, and um, they realize who he is because he makes he has like on his helmet he has like this camera so he can like videotape his fights and show it off on the web. And usually it's just like harmless stuff. We'll go out and like defeat things, like small mm -hmm. things. But then he ends up one night getting into like real deep stuff. And um, yeah, he ends up like getting in a fight with these bad guys. Like they're like kind of like a mafia type deal. Oh no. And then he posts that online and they get really mad. And then the Super Ninja see it because it becomes like this big internet sensation. Mm -hmm. And they um, help him get out of the mess. Oh, do people know that Spencer and Kickbutt are the same person, or no. is his identity hidden? It's hidden. It's really? like a Hannah Montana thing going on. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my goodness! So is it safe to say that you're, e you're that you're not evil? That you're a good character, or I'm is there some evil going he's on? He's not a villain. He's like more of just like he's gonna like if anything, he wasn't gonna hurt anyone else. He was just gonna end up hurting himself because he wasn't fit to be a superhero. So luckily, the super just come in and help out. Talk to me a little bit about the sets you worked on. It was I've really cool. I've seen some cool sets at Super Ninjas. We've been there a couple times yeah. now. Yeah, and I never have even shot on the Paramount lot before, so that was cool. Oh, neat. Yeah, so it was cool getting to shoot there. And also, like, have you been to the back lot, the New York thing? It was I just like have big not. New York, like a huge set, just like it looks like you're in New York City. Oh, cool. And it's did like you, outside, did and we got to shoot, shoot there. Did you get to shoot on that? Yeah, we got to shoot the really? last day, we got to shoot there. It was really fun. 
Oh, fun. And uh, what, what other sets were you on? I'd, I'd imagine you're um, at school. We were at bit. school. We were at um, a computer lab, a pizza parlor. And it, was, it was crazy how fast they put up those sets. Like, literally overnight, they put up the set. It's oh, crazy. Neat. Now, what was your favorite part working with the Super Ninja stars? Gracie, Carlos, yeah. and Ryan. They were all really cool. I actually already knew Carlos because he was in Fred, too. Oh, perfect. So yeah. I already knew he was, like, hilarious and awesome. And But meeting Ryan and Gracie was really cool, too. I remember Gracie made everyone cupcakes the last day. Oh my gosh, she's very well known for these cupcakes. Yeah. How did she specialize them for your episode? I remember she had two stacked up on each other and I was really glad that they were there because I remember it was lunch break and for some reason like <laughs> me and my sister, I don't know why we did this, but for some reason like we always order lunch in the morning and we like wanted to be healthy so we'd order like healthy, healthy lunches but then by the time oh, lunch no. came around, by the time lunch came around I was like starving. Right, so right. luckily there was cupcakes there. So okay. I remember we just wanted to see what it was like to be healthy for a week but it, yeah. obviously we've gone back to our old ways. That never works out, <laughs> yeah. that never works out. So we got some of Gracie's cupcakes. Did she decorate them any certain way? I mean they were stacked up on each other and I don't think she had like some stuff coming out of them and okay. stuff. It was cool. Interesting. Tasted good. Interesting. So what can we look forward to with this episode? Like, why should we all tune in? I mean, you guys should tune in to watch Super Ninjas, the Kickbutt episode, because first of all, the show is just a great show. I mean, it's comedy mixed with action. And then um, Super, I mean, Kickbutt, he's just like this... It's like just everyone, at least my dream, is to always be like a superhero, so it's cool like getting to see like someone who isn't cut out for the job, attempted at least. <laughs> yeah, totally. Uh -huh. Awesome. Well, thanks so much for joining us yeah, today. Yeah, thank this you for having me. It was fun for sure. Awesome. High five to you. I love <laughs> seeing this guy. Lucas Kruik, <laughs> thanks. you guys. Make sure you stay posted to Clever TV for more info on Super Ninjas and more. I'm Dana Ward for Clever TV, and we'll see you soon. Bye.